told y'all I took Milani to the hospital and she they told me they had hand, foot, and mouth disease. Or we want decoration or anything like that, go to Michael's. So so I don't normally come on here like this, but I had to. The last time you guys saw me was when I told y'all I took Milani to the hospital and she they told me they had hand, foot, and mouth disease. So I was okay. I didn't think anything of it. Um, we left the ER. The discharge nurse said her kids had it and they were fine, blah, blah, blah come home and I posted on Instagram and a lot of the moms were like did you go to the ER if or they give you steroids or a cream um, that they can prescribe for the itching the only thing they gave Milani was they gave her um, Motrin and I think Motrin and another form of liquid medication. They didn't prescribe her anything for her skin. I'm so pissed off. Do you guys know how hard it is to watch my daughter scratch from head to toe saying she's itchy and I can't do anything it's like torture it's literally like fucking torture and knowing that there's something that they could have prescribed for her and they didn't do it really pisses me the fuck off because they do this to black people all the time which is why i normally like going to black doctors a white doctor is who treated her in the er I'm really pissed off. The only thing they saw is a black mom with two toddlers. Okay. That's all they saw. And a black child. And they always assume that our kids are stronger. And they can withstand more than their white counterparts. And it, it's really annoying to know that this is the same field that i am trying to get into this is the shit that i'm gonna have to sit and watch these motherfuckers do like there's no way i can be in the healthcare field and watch people do this And my daughter saw me crying. It's funny as hell because my daughter is emotionally intelligent enough to know that I'm crying. And when I'm crying, it's okay. She asked me if I'm okay. She didn't just sit there and watch me cry. And she came and gave me a hug. My son does the same thing. And I normally don't cry in front of my kids, but... If I didn't cry just now, I'll probably have a brain aneurysm thinking about this fucker. But anyways, I'm going to go get myself together because your girl is going through it. Oh. oh and before Wee. anybody asks, I'm definitely using uh -huh. cortisol 10 um on her skin but it's not helping she's itching and scratching anyway i'm also sick Ouch. while she is sick one minute i'm hot i'm cold i have a headache i'm on my period like there's so many things going on at once but it's crazy and i'm also blaming myself because the only place they have gone in the last two days was the park and Babe also had his eye surgery, which makes this even worse. Um, it's it's just so much going on. So, 
yeah, the girl is stressed and depressed at the moment. But <coughs> and also, out of all my children, my daughter, my daughter with the most sensitive skin gets this. If a mosquitoer ants be her, it takes months to go away. All this all over her skin. Man. I'm about to start crying again, so I'm going to get off here. <laughs> Deuces. So, I'm in the hospital. I'm going to go rest. So the last time y'all saw me, I was probably in the hospital. And before that, I was probably crying about Malani. Getting hand, foot, mouth disease. But we're at the park and they have this tree and I'm picking up some of this stuff for my Christmas decoration so. <coughs> I just had to take my time step away and get my life together because I was going through it anyways there uh-huh uh-huh Raspberries. 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 That's not no raspberries, girl. Leave it alone. Mm, yummy. Ah, 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 ah. Cheese. Seen another one. Yes, uh, come, come, mommy. This way. Uh huh. So these are what I got so far. I have some more up there. Mm. Mm, I don't like that one. Living her best life. Where are you going? I'm gonna get some small ones and then we're gonna go. So good morning. It's Friday. I have a few things to do today. A willy bombs. So it's later on. I'm actually at my doctor's appointment to get my dental cleaning. That's what I'm about to do, and then I'm gonna go up to Good um, Home Goods and Michaels and see what they have as far as um, vases are concerned. So let's get into it. I'm a bit late, I'm minutes behind. So just got my teeth cleaned. My mouth is numb as hell. Um, that is one of the best teeth cleanings I've had. Um, she she numbed my mouth. She got in there. She moved away my gums and everything. 
now i'm at home goods and marshall's i love this little plaza because home goods and marshall's are right next to each other i love that for me home good and michael's not marshall's but marshall's is here so home goods marshall's and michael's right next to each other so i can just go into home goods and go into michael's and call it a day so that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go look for my look for a vase for my cinnamon sticks and i also need some things some i need to put something in my little bouquet my fall bouquet so that my flowers can actually stick together because they're just spread out and i don't like how it looks so that's what we're doing let me get out of here and show you. for vase and I'm picking up Christmas stuff. It's hilarious. Nice stuff in here. Really nice. So it's dark again. Let's see. Yeah. Okay. Babe texted me. Hold on. I don't reach to him. Just did. So just got back from home goods and michael's so this is what i got i got this big vase for my cinnamon sticks i got this for i don't know why my damn camera is doing this but i got this and this was 9.99 i got this for christmas decoration i also got a sand and fog coastal holiday three wick this smells so good and then i also got this i 
and I also got this so I think those are the only things that I'm going to get for um, Christmas I'm still gonna I think I'm gonna do a glam farmhouse theme glam farmhouse winter glam red no glam red farmhouse theme and I also got these to make my bouquet my Christmas bouquet um, if you're in Michael's or have a Michael's close near you all Christmas stuff is 40% off so I would suggest if you're planning on decorating and you want a tree or you want decoration or anything like that go to Michael's so so this was $14.99 think it's worth it <clears throat> sorry I think it's worth it some things honestly some things in home good are overpriced to me if I'm being really honest some of the stuff is definitely overpriced This is made of 100% recycled glass, so shout out to me for being good to the environment. <laughs> some more cinnamon sticks so this is how it looks it looks really good it looks way better than the other one I need to clean that off But it looks good. I think I'm gonna get more cinnamon sticks and put them in there. Cause this cinnamon sticks actually smells up the whole house. I love it a lot. So yeah. But I'm going to end the vlog now. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in, oh my bra strap is up. And I'll see you in the next one. Deuces.